So, everybody, all the people that are watching this, do you know who Underdog is? No? Well, let me introduce him to you. Underdog is the star of the of the 1964 cartoon titled Underdog. It ran for, it, yes, I'm Pluto, I'm actually speaking. It ran from 1964 to 1969, and it is a parody of Superman about an animal, about a dog who is a superhero. And he saves people. And this, and take, and defeats the people who wants to destroy the world and take over the world. It is pretty fun to watch. I watched it once and it was good. But one of the most iconic things about Underdog is that he got his own balloon in the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. Yep, you heard me. So, so, Herbax, you wanted us to make a Macy's Parade Balloon series? Welp, here we go. So let's take a look at Underdog's evolution in the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. Underdog made his first parade appearance as a balloon in 1965, with Total Television as his furniture, or in other words, his sponsor. Welp, his design is something that a lot of people say about some of the balloons. Even if I just started this season, generic. But however, he had one accident, and that was in 1975, where he was going down with a deflated ear and arm, but he hit a lamppost and his head popped, and he had to be removed. And he wasn't shown on TV either. So, we couldn't find a lot of footages, but we do have some. Two of them being 1976 and 1980. You know, it takes a crew of 31 to walk this bridge through the streets of Manhattan. Never fear, underdog is here. You know, shepherding these giant balloons through the gusty canyons of Columbus Circle, Times Square, and Harrow Square is tricky, and it requires a lot of skill. The handlers are directed by a captain, whose job is to pilot the balloons through the parade safely. Happy landings, underdog! I feel like I'm doing a kid's show. I am. of things to come featuring Rex Smith, Linda Ronstadt, and George Rose. Now, if you happen to suddenly come into a room and find your pet dog wearing a strange red and blue costume or standing on a chair stretching his front paws out in an unusual way, there's really nothing to be concerned about. Your pet is just trying to bring his fantasies to life to become the one, the only underdog. And though many may be called, only one has been chosen. And he's here right now, that lovable protector of the weak, who in everyday life is disguised as humble shoeshine. But when the world calls out for a hero, it's underdog to the rescue. However, in 1981, Underdog got a new coat of paint to make him more colorful and alive. And I must say, it this looks really good. It it looks like it re yeah, look at this. It looks brand new. Thank you, Andrea. Very nice. Now, for anyone who owns a dog and loves 
a dog, as we all do. Do you ever have a feeling that they know more than they're telling us? Take a look in their eyes sometimes. They're a lot like our friend Underdog here, who disguises himself as humble shoeshine when he isn't out protecting the weak. Check around that closet, see if you can find an old costume back there. Might belong to your dog. There he is. continued for the next two years in 1982, 1983, and 1984. Just some people clowning around. Don't, yeah. mind. Don't mind them. <laughs> Don't mind them. Look what's coming behind them, though. Balloon time. Oh. <laughs> you know, if you look over a list of all the different animals that appear in this incredible parade, there's one kind that always seems to be the most honored, Ryan. It's dogs, of course, man's best friend. This morning, we're paying tribute to Snoopy and Benji, and perhaps the greatest of all canine heroes, and one of my favorites, Underdog! There he is, flying high in his familiar blue and red costume, and talk about an inflated chest. He couldn't be prouder of being a regular part of this holiday. Underdog! My kind of guy. What a terrific little guy he is. Huh? With the big U on his jersey there. I just love him. I love it. Underdogs. We have any facts on underdog? Look at this. 63 and a half foot body. That doesn't sound too under to me. <laughs> no. No, <laughs> and about 8,000 cubic feet of helium. That's a lot of hot sounds air. Sounds like your local favorite, I'd say. <laughs> underdogs have a little problem maneuvering the quarter. Turn right. Turn right. Oh, yeah. Underdog's going to do a nosedive. Turn right. Uh-oh. Look, look out. Look out. Underdog. Whoa. Oh, I made it. Underdog, stay up. Stay up. Stay up. That's There's good. a couple of street lights there that he almost met. You've got to make a couple of lights yourself, yes, right? Yes, I do. Yes, I am. It's my turn. Where are you going? 34th Street side of the parade? Uh-huh. Okay, you I got sure a camera position over there? Uh-huh. Are you leaving me for keeps? Oh, no. I'm okay. going to go over there. Okay. Oh, yeah. You know who I hear is coming? I'm going to join you over there. Big fella. Fat. Red suit. Beard. My kind right. of guy, too. Yeah. yeah. All right. This is coming in so Santa. It's coming on the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. We'll continue our coverage right after this. It's a morning when the entertainment just doesn't stop. Bands play, shirt tails sing, and the Rockettes dance. Only here on NBC. As much as anything in this parade, the balloons year after year continue to fascinate people, and this one is now doing so for the 18th time. The balloon I'm sure you recognize as Underdog. Underdog looking as frisky as ever, ready to go off to combat with any bad guys who want to take him on. Looks like he's doing a lot better than he was doing up on Central Park West earlier, doesn't he? I would think so. 63 and a half foot body, I'm not sure that makes him an underdog. Underdog. You've seen him before. He's got a terrific view of the crowds below. We've got quite a crowd here today. This is Underdog's 20th stroll down Broadway. Has more dog walkers than even the richest pooch.
underdog. After the 1984 parade, Underdog was retired, making a total of 20 appearances. Yeah, this character made more. Yes, now we're going on to an even more known character. But and yes, Underdog may have made 20 appearances, and this character made only six. Um, no, uh, seven, but he is more well known. I'll give you a hint. Our next character we're gonna look at is a bear from London.